All right, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, sisters of YouTube. It's obvious that here in America that there's a war against black people. It's obvious. Uh, we can try to sweep it under the rug. Uh, we can try to ignore it. We can try to paint a picture contrary to what reality is, all we want. But the fact of the matter is, is that black people today are dying unjustly at the hands of these rogue cops. Now, for some time, I've been in contact with a few attorneys uh, about starting an organization. Uh, because, you know, you know what I mean, to be politically correct, that's what they say, uh, to be legally and lawful in this particular country right here, which is definitely just gone wild. But it's obvious that these cops need to be put in check. And I'm going to give all of you out there an, um, an idea of what I'm speaking about. I want you all to listen to me very closely. What I'm proposing is, is this, is I'm proposing an organization called Cop Watch. And uh, I'll pretty much give you um, the gist of it right now. The idea is, is that whenever Americans, be you black, white, red, yellow, blue, purple, green, brown, polka dot, makes no difference to me. Whenever you are pulled over on allegedly a routine traffic stop, is that we would have an app on our phones that would immediately alert the citizenry to actually come close to, at least mobilize around that area to surveillance and watch these cops um, as they're doing their so-called legal and lawful duty, that it doesn't go wrong um, uh, on, on the spot, if you understand what I mean. Because it's obvious that they need to be watching. We're not going to stop all these heinous deaths um, and, and, and all this acquittal of criminals. Uh, I mean, after all, if Hillary Clinton can get off on Benghazi, get off on these emails and stuff, and then we get prosecuted and then uh, um, uh, sent up for some of the just uh, minute what they call crimes today and stuff, you can see obviously that this criminal syndicate called the U.S. government is against the people. That's all there is to it. So I'm proposing an organization by the name of Cop Watch to where we have an app to be able to mobilize again around any routine traffic stop. Um, and we need to do this in this country in order to protect ourselves from those who are so-called <clears throat> have authority over us, if you want to put it that way. Because if we don't do something, it's obvious that our government is not going to do anything. They're going to constantly be acquitted over and over and over again. And we can't continue to keep standing by playing this game um, and, and allowing them to continue to keep having power over us when we the people are the ones that are supposed to allegedly have the power. Um, when you look at Sandra Bland uh, and you look at some of these other people who have died unjustly under the hands of this system and then these cops get acquitted over and over and over again, we need to start practicing and exercising the power of the people that we have. Um, and until we start doing something about it, you can forget about it ever stopping because they will lie. You see that uh, right on the spot in order to protect their their selves from this um, so-called uh, American people. Because once they get into that justice system, we see that there's no justice for us. There's only justice for them. And that's it. Um, so we live in a land to where there ain't no such thing as justice um, because these cops are too busy trying to be lawful based on the laws that are based on their system. So again, cop watch. Pass this around. Tell me what you think uh, and help me. Help me. Get all this together um, for the American people uh, so we can actually do something to stop all these heinous crimes because we do not, no longer possess a government of the people, for the people, and by the people. And that's the truth. And that's the truth straightway.